Welcome to Milestones for your Kindle Improvement series. This series is designed for you to pass Shodan, Nidan, and Sandan exam by improving your Kindle step by step. I have PDF files for you to download at kindleguide.com, so please visit kindleguide.com. For the detail, please click the link below. I hope you enjoy the video. Okay, so when you strike men, I see, okay, you learn men strike like this, right? Okay, now that's good. Now, a lot of people start doing... This type of men strike. From here, you loosen your elbows, so it comes down first, and they push their men, uh, shinai forward like that, so it's one, two movements, like that. Uh, that is not right. So from here, from here, it is true that your elbow comes down and then this has to stop and strike man. That's true, but it's not sudden drop and strike man. Okay, that's one thing you have to remember when you sh strike man. Okay, now uh, when you do small man strike, this this habit becomes this kind of thing, this type of man strike. So the problem here, from here you push down your sword like that. So you are losing the power. We are going to cut, so Shinai has to go up and down. Not up, kind of, you're sliding in like this. It is true when you strike man from here, man, right, man, and you go towards your opponent, maybe they are exaggerating this motion by doing this but again you're going to lose the power because you have to go down not slide forward okay to to fix that okay have your left hand right here this is my main position left hand it's not too low not too high if you end up man like this you're so uh you're this is not this is not you're supposed to strike men too low you're losing your posture too your left uh, hand should be about solar plexus okay and the right hand is about chest height like that okay and then to practice from here what we do is for small strikes okay what we do up right and down that's basically what we are doing now because our target is forward upright and move this forward and Shinai goes forward automatically okay and again we are going forward right so this is going forward if I if object imagine you put an object stick uh, let's say bicycle or something moving forward and you hit the brake all of a sudden what happens to this it goes forward right so our body is moving forward okay so stick is going the shina is going forward if i stop my uh, left hand here this goes forward okay so all the power goes into the shina so from here you go I stop it here, it started going forward. Okay, and stop here, the snag goes forward. All right, so that's the physics. So from here, all you have to do is, you don't have to go like this, okay? From here, decide which, where you wanna stop your left hand. Okay, from here, I wanna stop from here, okay? So I go, boop move forward as you move 
move forward, start stretching your left hand forward. Not like this, okay? Just forward. Bang. From here, bang. okay? Not like this again. Bang. Okay, so this is, so this, this part goes towards your opponent. Okay, and then with the right hand, you, a lot of people think you have to grab at the same time, but if it's at the same time, you can't really have a good sharp uh, strike. So what I recommend is this has already power, okay? This has already power. So you have to, it, when you strike, it bounces up. So right hand, with the right hand, you catch it. Okay, from here go. Okay, if you go at the same time, you're kind of, you have too much strength, your shoulders get stiff, but you're kind of catching them, catching the shinai. Almost at the same time as the impact, but at the same time, it will stop. Okay, you don't want to push down or anything. So, catch. Okay, so that's what I recommend for you to do. Now again, when you strike men, don't go or you don't want to go down. Okay, right hand should be relaxed. Decide which, where your left hand goes. Okay, with the momentum of your body going forward, this goes forward. Anyway. So don't, you don't need power in your upper body or shoulders. Be nice and relaxed. Okay, so you can strike, you can you strike using the whole body rather than arms. Okay, so I want you to study uh, main strike. This is going to be your tenochi. So tenochi, people think is about palm. It is true, but gotta use all the body. And then when to when to grab your shinai is most important with the right hand. Okay, from here. Okay, if you can do that, uh, you can improve your kendo uh, dramatically in the future. Okay. I would like to send special thanks to patrons for their constant support through patreons.com slash kendo for life.